was Ed ever a human? Ed. No. Is Ed a spirit? Listen, li listen to what? Ever since I decided to go full time with Saving Ghosts and put it on the YouTube, the overall experience has been fantastic. I can't say enough about the people that I've met and the experiences that I've had. However, one thing that has become a regular in this, and it hasn't just been me, others who have worked in ITC and paranormal has also experienced this as well. There's been one name that has appeared on a pretty regular basis, and that name is Ed. Now, the thing is, I don't know who or what this Ed is, and what I've tried to find out in the past, the sessions have become garbled. I am going to try again tonight to contact this mysterious Ed, see who or what they are and what they want. Stick around. This is Philip. Is there anybody here? Hi guys, this is Philip. I mean no harm. I said to my prayer beforehand, I'm asking once again that my archangels, my protectors, be here during this session. Okay? I mean, no harm. No. I mean, I mean no harm to anyone. Miss, who is who, who are you? What was your name? The lady, the lady who just spoke. You. Okay, guys. So. If if it's okay, I would like to ask a question. Oh, I'm sorry. Who is Ed? Who is the one that calls himself Ed? To know who this Ed is. Is Can you tell me what Ed's purpose is? Protector? Hey, Miss, I thought I heard you say yeah. If Ed is a protector, who is Ed protecting? Because other people 
have had Ed come through their sessions. Does Ed help? Does Ed help facilitate communication between spirit and the living? Or is Ed a troublemaker? Again, I'm only asking because I don't know. Is Ed someone important? Okay. Is Ed a spirit? Listen, li listen to what? Tell you what, guys, let's do this. I'm going to. camera shutting off. Was that one of you or was that just the camera? Yes. I'm going to turn the volume down for you so I can ask my question. After I ask the question, I will turn the volume back up. Okay, and then give your answer, or at least try to, okay? Sure. Thought I heard a sure. Okay, well, I'm going to run with it. Okay, so volume is down. Okay, guys, so I've been trying to figure out who Ed is. Is Ed actually the spirit's name? Um, Said yes. Uh, sure. Sure. Okay. Thank you. I heard that. Um, was Ed ever a human? Ed. No. Okay, thank you. Uh, is Ed a spirit or something else? Okay, so earlier I thought I heard someone say us. Is Ed not just one spirit or entity, but many? Can someone please explain why does Ed come into my sessions sometimes? Okay, I heard you say he's gone. I 
thought I heard that help. Sir, did you say help? Yes. Right there. Guys, if you are looking for help, ask for Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, Gabriel. They can help you. Request that you learn how to go into the light, that you can pass into the light. I don't know if there's anything that you have to work on or if you have to learn, but um, Raphael and, and Michael, they can teach you what it is or tell you what it is that you need to know to cross into the light. So ask for them, okay? Got it. Can someone please clarify for me who or what Ed is? All right, guys. I want to thank you for your time. Peace. Who is that? So, here's the thing. Even after this session, I still don't know who this Ed is. What he or she wants, or whether it's a spirit, or they're good or bad. I have no idea. The one thing that did come out of this, though, is that it seems to me that Ed, perhaps, is not just one spirit, but a collective of spirits. I don't know. I would be curious to see what you all have to say, so go ahead and put them in the comment section below and uh, let me know what your thoughts are. If I should continue seeking out this Ed, or let it be and just see if Ed just fades away. Alright guys, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Take care. Bye-bye.